Apple Arcade has just quietly revealed four upcoming games, so today we're going to take a closer look at them. Samurai Jack is taking what was cool from the iconic TV series and translating it into a stylish action game. It almost looks like it was created through Dreams on PS4, which isn't a bad thing. I really love the game's art style. Players will journey through time as Jack and will try to finally stop Aku's evil reign. The game is said to be voiced by the original voice actors and will implement fluid 3D action, open-ended worlds, platforming and side-scrolling gameplay. It will have a robust skill tree and lots of different weaponry to use. For example, a classic sword, a bow and arrow, guns, throwable weapons and so forth. Honestly, it's not doing anything ambitious, but the game does look really fun and even challenging at times, and if you're a fan of the classic or modern show, it should be right up your alley. Samurai Jack Battle Through Time is coming the 21st of August 2020 on PC and console. That said, there has been no announcement on when the Apple Arcade version is coming. Hopefully it's the same day, but I, I don't know, I don't know. What you're looking at here in Last Camp Fire is a story of rekindling hope in an otherwise hopeless world. You play as Ember, who is trapped in a strange place and just wants to get back home. You will go on a big journey and will travel into a dark and mysterious forest. As you travel, you must help a light known as Hope find and light the last campfire, hence the name of the game. This one is made by Hello Games, the people behind No Man's Sky. According to the developer, The Last Campfire brings new ideas and aims to make an artistically focused single player adventure game. The result is something in which the player becomes lost within a storybook world, traveling through beautiful environments, meeting strange and unusual characters in a heartfelt story. Last Campfire is coming sometime in summer 2020. 12 kids going on a 1200 kilometer journey is what World's End Club is about. The game has really pretty graphics and features famous locations from all over Japan. The game's aesthetic does remind me of the other upcoming Apple Arcade game, Fantasian, but this one uses 2D side-scrolling with 3D backgrounds. This makes it stand out from the crowd. The story follows a group of students who are involved in a terrible school accident. When they wake up, mysterious things are happening all over the earth and inside them. I'm really excited for World's End Club. It looks to have a very well thought out story and unique characters. The game is said to release sometime soon. Beckett is just a simple career going about his simple life until one day he decides to go on a dangerous space adventure with a former bounty hunter. This game is made by the creators of Oxen Free and After Party, so you can be sure it will have witty and polished writing. It actually brings an intelligent conversation system with branching dialogue that changes your relationship and the story. Players can also use a spaceship to fly around dodging gangsters, bounty hunters and the dangers of space. This spaceship also has its own personality. Whatever that means, I don't know. Next Stop Nowhere is coming very soon exclusively on Apple Arcade. Here is a bonus game that is rumoured to be coming to Apple Arcade. Alba, a wildlife adventure, has not been confirmed as coming to Apple Arcade, but the fact that it has been announced for iPhone, iPad, Apple TV and Mac has me thinking it's very likely coming our way. It's also by Ostwoy Games, the people behind Assemble With Care on Apple Arcade. Regardless of where it ends up, I'm just really looking forward to trying this one out. It looks cool. What do you think of these upcoming games? Will you play them? 
Are you still subscribed to Apple Arcade? Or are you just waiting for more games to come? Let me know in the comments. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like to show your support. And while you're at it, you should turn on notifications and subscribe to be alerted about future Apple Arcade releases. Anyway, my name's Stewie and thanks for watching.